Welcome back to IES Tech. In this video, I am going to show how you can create custom prompts along with variables using Open Web UI. In prompts, you can add simple variables or special variables, as well like clipboard variable. If you use clipboard variable, then it automatically inserts the content of clipboard as soon as you use the prompt. So let's begin. First of all, open the Open Web UI in your browser. Then click on the Workspace link on the top left side. Then click on Prompts tab. And then click on the plus icon on the left side to create new prompt. You will see this new form to create custom prompt. Here you have to type the name of the prompt. While typing the name of the prompt, it will automatically generate the command. But you can also customize that command name below the title of prompt. Then you need to type your prompt. And there, you may add your variables if needed. To add variable you, just have to wrap your variable name with two curly braces. This will create the placeholder for variable. And if you also want to add variable for the clipboard, then you have to type the clipboard with all capital letters. Once you are done, click on the Save button. After saving, open a new AI chat. Before using prompt, I will first copy some text so that I could show you the clipboard usage as well. I generated some text with AI and copied it. Now to use prompt in the chat input, Type slash and type the name of the command. While typing the name of the prompts, it will suggest you matching suggestions of available prompts. Select your desired prompt. You see that as soon as I selected the prompt, it loaded prompt content in Textaria. And you also would notice that it inserted the clipboard content that I copied earlier. Other than that, you can see all placeholders for the variables that I added. To insert data into those variables, you just press Tab button several times, and it will automatically select the placeholders on every tab press. And when it selects the text, you can just type the value for those variables. Once you are done, submit prompt, and you will get the response form AI. Let me show you another example of clipboard. I will select another piece of text on my clipboard and will select my same prompt again. And this time, you will see different text in my prompt because of different clipboard text. All right, that's all what I wanted to show you in this video. I hope that you will find this video useful. If so, then please like and share this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also, please don't forget to click on the bell icon to get notified for my other upcoming useful videos. If you have any questions, feedback, or suggestions for next video topic, then please feel free to leave them in the comments section below. I will do my best to reply you as soon as possible. Thanks again for watching my video. Hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye.